everyone? Looney Farm Guy here with a new mod test for Friday, October the 7th. And this is the McCormick Cotton Trailer Pack <clears throat> by Hispano. It is 19.64 megabytes to download. 11 slots on console. It's a pack of two cotton bale trailers. Now, if you think these look familiar, you would be absolutely correct. They are versions of the base game um, <clears throat> cotton trailers. However... If we take a look at it in our store, under Cotton Technology, uh, here is the McCormick uh, Cotton Trailer. Uh, three bales, though, only, and that is the uh, Liftable Bales Pack, so that's a different mod. However, this is the standard, let's see, main colors, yeah. So, what is different about this mod? Well, we have the standard three bale trailer, which is still $89,000 <clears> and will hold up to 238 centimeter bales, which is uh, which is the standard cotton bale size. Yes, of course. So we have plenty of wheel choices. The rim um, wheel brands, um, all of them, as you can see. And let's see here, which ones, uh, you can have some Vertistein, you can have wide choices, not Midas, Nokian is like that, Nokian's nice. <clears throat> Continental, we have uh, Twins, which is nice, or Narrow, kind of a narrow tire, that's kind of cool, although I would imagine be a little tippy, perhaps. Um, and then Trelleborg, we have some nice wide ones. And Michelin, wides again. BKT, wides. I think Vertistein, we've seen that already. So there you go. <clears throat> Side lights, yes or no. Beacons, we have our choice of, and that's going to be up here on this um, right right forward of that side wheel <clears throat> so we have a, up to 11 different types of beacons which is interesting uh, hitch configuration we have the standard pin hitch we have a semi truck hitch and we have a gooseneck hitch colors we have a bunch of extra colors including these chrome yellow John Deere chrome ooh a kind of what is that called challenger chrome that's kind of a darker gold color <clears throat> orange chrome so we have all the pink chrome Ooh. Uh, also up here there's a pink and then there's this oh a matte pink cool um yeah so lots lots matte matte colors chrome colors Chrome, chrome, ooh, shiny. Uh, so you get the idea there. Uh, rim colors, of uh, all the same choices for rim colors, and it changes all the rims on all the tires and in a license plate, right? <clears throat> so 93,000 for that. 11 slots for either one of these. Right-o, now let's hop in and get our help window on. <clears throat> And as you see, can see, I have three bales on here already. Uh, we have the standard operating unload. Um, that R1 and right stick is actually for the gooseneck. And I'll show you that right now. Let us back up. Now some trucks will attach to the gooseneck, some, uh, all semis will attach to the gooseneck as you can see here. Now if we go to L1 and square, that will put it into operating position like so. Now there is a note for this trailer and we're going to try it out right now. I haven't tried it yet so this is going to be the first time. Here we're going to pick up a bale. So he's extended this one to uh, hold five bales. Um, so note to unload the cotton trailer 5,000 when it has more than three bales. So we're gonna fill it up because I think it's a modified version of the three bale trailer, right? <clears throat> it sounds, that's what it sounds like. 
uh, if you're wondering where I got all these cotton bales, uh, it is part of the IBC. Oh, I'll, I'll, I'll if I remember, I'll pin it in the uh, in the description. It's a mod where you can buy all sorts of wonderful things from the store. It has made my life so much easier, uh, including buying cotton bales. Otherwise, I would have had to have made these cotton bales. That would have been painful. Right, so here we go. One last one. There we go. So when it when it's full... <clears throat> There we go. Um, so, transport position L1 and square again. Oh, and I was going to show you the adjustable uh, height on the hitch. R1 and right stick up and down. There we go. So you can adjust the height on that. That will work on any... That, it's not just the semis. Uh, anything that you have hooked it up to, it will do that. Right, so let's get into some open space here and see what this unloading procedure is all about. Uh, I see, I think I know what's going on here. It says, okay, I'll read it again. Note, to unload the cotton trailer 5000 when it has more than three bales, it is necessary to help unloading it by moving forward when the first three bales have already come out. So let us do that. L1 and triangle. Right, and then L1 and triangle again. I see, so it's pushing it out and it says you're gonna move forward a little bit because it's not strong enough to see, just like that. So that wasn't very hard. Um, and so what that is, is once the first three or four on the ground the belt to push them off is kind of getting stuck because it's trying to push all those bales. So all you do is like I did, just move forward like so. And uh, it's as in essence, help them to come off the um, trailer. Now L1 and triangle lowers that and it's back into transport position, just like so. And that's pretty much all there is to that. Um, it's nice to see a little bit of a larger cotton trailer to you know, two, well, two more extra bales. Um, if you like this style of, uh, of trailer, and definitely all the custom colors are very nice. And there you have it. That's the McCormick Cotton Trailer Pack by Hispano 19.4 or 64 megabytes to download. 11 slots each on console. Thank you for watching. I'm Looney Farm Guy, and remember, it's only a game. So till next time, bye for now.